I feel bad about Dude, Luke. Get... Jesus. He could have killed you. What the fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Okay. Kenny's out back trying to get some stupid truck started. Okay. Here, you should eat something. Is that a peanut butter? You okay? Thank you. Aw, thanks. Whatever, Mike. What is that that they're eating? I can't believe he's gone. Yeah, we can't. We should. I've lost people before. We should have able to, you know, take him, you know, from this, the water. This shitty in a while. We he have a great, great guy. guy. Yep. God damn it. I shouldn't have come back. I knew this would happen. Yeah. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. Trust me. Yep. If you say so. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. To be honest, I feel like this game uh, dialogue make me want to make you know stay inside more, but yeah. I don't know. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. Gotta get moving, it, moving, moving. This house ain't worth a crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Sure, Kenny. Yep. This is spirit, darling. Yeah. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch him. Okay. Wait, why are you sad? Uh, what? Just be careful. It's okay, it's Kenny. Kenny not gonna harm us. He like kids, except Arbo, I guess. Wait, did Kenny and S uh, Sarah ever did interact, you know? I am so curious about that. If they interact, what topic do they, you know, have conversation with? Like, they have so different characters. Characteristic, you know. Maybe. What does she have to say? Uh, I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? We shouldn't. We didn't talk oh, about. We didn't talk about you. Really. <laughs> really, Kenny. I feel like Sarah's a little bit like yeah, Doc. Maybe I don't know. It's over. A little bit different. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing. All right. Okay. Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. If this truck's gonna go. My daddy always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. He was a mean son of a bitch, but he taught me respect. Okay. A girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. Yeah. Uh, she's not easy to like. She's not easy to like. Well, that's putting it mild. Feels like another Lily situation to me. No, more like Molly, to be honest. I like Jane. All right, give it a turn. Uh, turn. Turn what? Oh. Uh. Not so happen. close, Clem. A little bit of luck, I can get this thing running, and then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Stop behind me. Hunting's gotta be out there. But no one knows. Those rumors can't all be bunk. Well, hey, there's gotta true. be something out here other than snow and goddamn Euro trash. <laughs> what about Mexico? Why? You want a taco? <laughs> I've never been there. I went once, long time ago, just before I met Cap. What happened there? All right, turn it again. Oh, I forgot about this. I'm sorry. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it!
We get it working. We'll get it working. We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I gotta get this thing to start. Gonna try warming up the battery. One inside. I like leaving him with that girl. Okay, we're going to look at the excavator, I guess. Wish they'd finished this place. Wish they'd finished with this place. Talk to Bonnie. What do you want? I want to see how I you work. I just wanted to see how you work. How do you think? You blame me for looks dead? Come on! It must be nice being a pretty little girl. No one ever expects you to do a damn Bitch, thing. we do almost the damn thing. We always do the damn I thing. Like, we take the responsibility of an adult. You and I both know what happened back there. Yeah, but you didn't save him either. More to say to you. Oh, come on. Damn. You laying all out to her? Oh my god. Yeah, she should have done something, but at the same time, should should have done something more, but at the same time, come on. He's 11. I mean, he shoot the eyes. And uh, follow your rules to, you know, wait, I want to vent this before anything happen. You know, Clem, follow your rules instead of, uh, instead of obeying, you know, what his name again, Luke's order. You shoot the eyes, you bang the eyes, and you almost reach, okay, the, went in the eyes and almost reach, uh, Luke. It's kind of my fault at the same time, but at the same time, you know, what did you expect? We are short. We are children. We cannot, our body is not as strong as our body. I'm like an adult. Like Clementine's body is a child, you know. Don't expect him to, you know, be strong in, you know, cold places and be, you know, able to endure, you know, in cold places, right? Like, don't put me in the blame for all this. Like, girl, you you literally make the ice go cracking a little bit bigger because you want to save your little prince, bitch. And what did you get? Because you are too heavy, the ice become bigger and you also stuck in there. And what happened in the water? Like, like you saw you in, you know, you and Luke in the water, right? But why aren't you anywhere near Luke, you know? That's what I'm weirded out. Aren't you the same places, you know? Like when you're in the water, don't you see Luke? You, I mean, you went on the same hole, right? Where Clem break the ice. Why aren't you, when you went up, why aren't you also taking Luke with you? That's what I'm so curious about. Oh my gosh. I am so mad about this filler character. Because now other than, you know, uh, other than country accent, uh, pretend to be lie that she's in prison, used to be in prison. And what is it again? Uh, wait, is that it? Uh, jacket. Oh yeah, the jacket. Other than the tree. Oh wait, four. Uh, lacking apparently lacking loop. Other than that four, you ain't you ain't shit. Like you, your character isn't that important. Like how are you still alive right now? Aren't you like uh the same as Carver's? I mean, lower than Carver's type of character. You know what I'm saying? But whatever. Let's just 
make this filler character get mad at us, even though we are 11, 11 years old child, okay? Oh my gosh, I am so mad at Bonnie that my voice is losing. Come on. Come on, me. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go. Oh my gosh, I am so mad at Bonnie right now. Hey. Hey. Hey now, hey now. I can Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. This is what dreams are made of. Hey now, hey now. Before. Son of a bitch. I can't believe. Oh, I've seen it too. I've seen it too. A few times. Oh. And you know what's about to happen. I mean, kind of. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy too. Once. Okay. Probably had a nice job. A so nice you're saying he's car? He's a car? Oh, new Carver? Okay. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Oh. Damn! You talk about that with a child, okay? Kenny isn't Kenny Carver. Is yeah. The same is Sarah isn't oh, Jamie, is. bitch. Start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. Whatever. You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. That's worth more than you, I guess. Oh. I think it needs food or something. Oh. Aww. Seems like you've done that before. Wanna try? You wanna try? No way. <laughs> puke. Clem, no. Hold it like this. Hey. Hi. <laughs> My name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. It's not gonna puke. I mean, yeah, you cover in <laughs> puke. It in, puked. You know, gross. In, you know, zombie guts. So that's why they puke. You know. Oh, you happy? There's not much left. Oh. I was running with some people a long time ago down near DC. DC, so where's that? Got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Mary Jane? Oh, anyway, like a Spider-Man thing. got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Okay. Lost four people before we got him out. Oh. Oh. So he made it? So he made it? Bit. Oh my gosh, that is so way Find cool. Until later, he was already bit. Turn and rip the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky. Like she was watching a bird. Oh god, that is so graphic towards a child. Oh. He got it working. Oh, okay. Damn, I know Kenny can do it. He's a car god, you know? It works. It works. What I tell you? What I tell you? So what's the plan? What's the plan? What's How the much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? We need to find a place for the baby. Yup. Yeah, someplace warm. I agree. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're gonna freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? House? What? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? Texas? The fuck? It was just fuck? an idea. We already talked about this. Really? We did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Uh... Wellington? Wellington. Penny, it's freezing up here, man. Let's sleep on it. We don't have to leave right now. Let's just sleep on it. Well, that sounds sensible. Damn it, we don't have time. Says you. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, 
So I say where we go. And we're oh, fucking Penny, up. don't be so selfish. Says we gotta help an AJ. What about Arbo? Ooh, oh, Arbo? Risky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. Why? Oh, yeah. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. We should ask He's him, dumb. you know? We should ask him what he wants. There's a concept. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh, yeah, some help he's been. He got Luke killed. I gotta it's say Bonnie. Situation. But maybe if you'd eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. I mean, if yeah, only Leaf here. Uh, there could be a herd out there. Uh, Kenny's relationship well, and Arbor would probably be different, down, you know? Haven't we been through enough? Like, Kenny again? isn't built for leadership, you know? Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. I'm going inside! God damn it! Are you okay? Kenny, are you okay? No, he's not. Oh. I know this is gonna happen. That's why I hate this filler character. But whatever. You better talk some sense into him. For his sake. Okay. Oh shit. It's me. Clem. Sorry, just give me a second. Oh my gosh, I am so, so sorry Close for that. Door. Close the door. Can you believe this, Clem? I bring them a working truck, and they act like I just shit in their cereal. I knew Jane would have a stick up her ass, but I thought at least Mike would have more sense. He's turned out to be a real disappointment. Okay. Well, why can't we just leave tomorrow? Look, we got maybe a day's worth of oh, food for that okay. kid left. That's it. Okay, now I understand. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean, what if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. I know you're right. We owe it to them to see this done. I know, you're right. Someone's got to keep this group together. That kid's dependent. Okay, now I like his goal, okay. The thing is, Kenny isn't crazy at all. I mean, a little bit, but at the same time, his action is kind of reasonable, except the Arvo thing, you know? Not to keep that he doesn't do not trust anyone. I think he'd tell me to not trust anyone and to keep my hair short. can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of Wait, going Wait, is that a good that? decision? I don't know. That's what people like Lee knew. And what people like Jane won't ever understand. Kind of. I know Wellington might be bullshit. But where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? Yeah. You know, when I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. Yeah, for Krista's sake, we have to go to Wellington, right? And we shared that meal. Well, I could tell that you were different now. Grow. Grown up. Uh, I felt pride. A pride Aww, felt a Kenny. <laughs> but I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. Something has to be out here. We'll find it, Kenny. Yep. I knew I could count on you, Clem. The thing is, we, we owe it to Lee, Krista. Okay. We'll like Kenny, in the morning. you know, like they've been searching Wellington for on, all over, like sleep. for a long time, you know, especially Krista and Clementine. I feel like it is a valid decision to go to Wellington, you know, and the the reason why I chose Wellington because of that, like people died for us to be in that position, you know, and it is up to us to survive now after all the sacrifice that have been made. Yep, I know this is gonna happen. I know this is gonna happen. I know this is gonna happen. Oh, the car? Wait, what? Did, what is the thumping noise?
อา้าวยับยับ I got I know it I fucking knew it Oh my gosh my voice Mike Arvo and that bitch Bonnie Don't move Don't move Yep That food is for the baby bitch I'm sorry Wait why are you Come on Mike That food is for the baby Oh come on! We're just leaving. Bitch, what about us? We need food. And you have the rest of the supplies? Nobody else has. That's everything we have. That's everything we have. Bitch, are you a monster? Listen, we just gotta get away from that guy, Clem. Okay? Oh my gosh, you guys are so okay. selfish. Damn, did Arvo really manipulate you guys to be on his side? Oh my gosh. Come on. All right, Clem. Now I'm gonna walk up to you nice and slow. Jane, help! Jane, help! They're robbing us! Oh, fuck. No! Bitch, now you're on... Jesus. Bitch! Just yeah, that's what you get for trusting Arvo. Like, you trust Arvo more what? than Clementine? What the fuck did you do? What the hell? I got... Oh my god. Oh my god. I am so mad that at this. Did Arvo really follow you guys? I am so sorry. Oh my gosh, this makes me so mad. I am so sorry. Oh my god. I know this is gonna happen. But damn, Arvo really did did something to us. Come on. Wait, I'm gonna search something if Arvo really did follow Mike and Bonnie at the end because if I was either Bonnie or Mike after saw Arvo shot Clem I would not trust Arvo you know like at the end of the day even if we betray Clementine I still trust her more right rather than Arvo and you and they oh my gosh I hate Arvo so much Wait, I'm searching something if Arvo really did follow them. After all, after they, you know, after they shoot Clem, like, did they allow Arvo to let in the car? Like, damn, they have such a low standard on survival. Why Arvo? Okay, so this is a, one of the theories that I will see on the supplies as Kenny took the truck and supplies after they ran off. From what I remember, Bonnie also reacted very visibly upset at Mike when Arvo shot Clem. So I don't think she ran with them. And Arvo looked very panicked before running off wildly. I think they all got lost or ran separate ways. Given a blizzard roll through the walkers in it, I honestly don't even think they made it out. Next few days, given there are barely any shelter at all nearby. Given Bonnie can die by drowning in the lake in a cut cutscene, Mike can be shot dead. I don't think so. Okay. And I have absolutely no sympathy for them. For Arbo, it's obvious why. It's obviously why. But for Mike, people forget just how scum his action were in the stealing supplies from Clem and AJ. Yup. And even if he has a problem with Kenny, who admittedly does have major mental instability issue and does not excuse stabbing a kid and infant for food. Yup. Oh my gosh, uh, I think they, I think they, you know, went together, you know, run together, I guess, I don't know.